This is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. What's going on, everyone? This is Jacob Shoup. You're watching the 4 p.m. stock market update right here on TFNN. I hope you all had a great day. I know we got one last trading day tomorrow. Um, we're going to start fresh on Monday. Uh, let's take a look what we got going on with the composite. We have basically sideways right now at the end of the day, up 0.03% at 18,972. The Dow Jones Industrial up about 1.06%. Yet that SPY trading up 0.54% at 593 and 72 cents. The dollar is strong. 107.01 right now for the day. Yeah. There you go. I think that's the high. Okay, no. 107.15 is the high, but we're right under there uh, right now. You have the crude oil uh, about 2.18% at $70.25. You have the gold contract at 0.84% uh, to the upside, trading at $2,673.90. Now, I just had Tim Ord on during the show. If you missed that or want to go back over, you can go to our YouTube channel, Tiger Financial News Network. At the end of programming today, our producer is always hard at work getting those clips up for you. He had a great analysis on gold, kind of his uh, look at it going forward. Of course, you can go visit the Ord-Oracle.com as well. Uh, but if you do go to our YouTube, please consider liking the video and consider subscribing because it helps us out immensely. You have copper up about or off about 1.08%, trading at $4.11. Silver off about 0.5%, $30.85. And that Russell is strong as well, up about 1.6% today at 2372 Let's see, anything else freaky? Disney. Oh, man, it's just like, it brings a tear to my eye, you know? I'm so happy that this is no longer killing my portfolio anymore. And uh, I'm struggling with it a little bit. I'm like, should I just get rid of this thing? Uh, I, I will probably do just a closer look for myself, see if I want to hold it. But, you know, it's so much capital to put into, you know, really good stocks like ARB or something like that. Uh, let's see, anything lucid, not doing too much today, up about 1.48%. And then Tesla kind of sideways right now. You had some interesting stuff with some of these uh, automakers trying to actually lobby Trump to keep the EV tax credit. Because it's like, yo, man, we have all this, <laughs> we have all this inventory, nobody bought it. Please, please do something to make people buy these EVs. In a while. Folks, thank you so much for joining me. We're going to be joined by Tommy O'Brien tomorrow morning for the morning market kickoff at 9 a.m. Eastern Time. Then followed by Basil Chapman. Uh, then Steve Rhodes. Of course, Larry Pesavento's live trading is going on. And then I will not be here tomorrow. Take care. See you Monday.